How's it going, everybody? I'm Andy. You know Dylan. And the Dodgers have evened up the World Series at two games apiece. Big win for the Dodgers tonight here in game four. What were your impressions, Dylan? Yeah, I'm not going to be able to go trick-or-treating with my children. There will be a game six now, which falls on Halloween night. Yep. So I just want to give a quick shout to my children. Naomi, Landon, I'm very sorry. I'm probably going to disappoint you a lot in the future. Uh, so I guess kind of get used to it. Kids, look at this as a building block for your future therapy sessions, explaining why you have all the issues you have. The Dodgers, though, solved some of their issues tonight. Cody Bellinger got going. Mm -hmm. Alex Wood, you know, look, you've made fun of me for how I've written about heroic performances for guys only going five or six innings, but Alex Wood going five and two-thirds was huge for them. Yeah, you know, and I mean, I, I still kind of go back. when I think of, Every time I think of Alex Wood, I, I go back to April, mm -hmm. you know, when the Dodgers break camp and he's told that he's not going to be one of the five guys in the rotation. You know, we've seen, right, guys of, you know, varying degrees of accomplishment, how they react right. when things don't go their way. And I really kind of, I thought Alex Wood showed a lot in April by mm -hmm. not, you know, pouting, by no. not complaining, that the fact that he just kind of went out there, just kept doing his work. By the end of the month, he's in the rotation, yep. makes the all-star team. And I, th I thought it really showed a lot about his character, you know. And obviously during the second half of the season, we saw him fade. Mm -hmm. um, so, you know, I was never, I never questioned whether he had the heart mm -hmm. or the determination to come and, you know, flourish on the stage. I did wonder if he still had the arm strength right. at this point. That was the big, that was the big question. And his tonight, stuff, yeah. and, he, and he was great tonight. Yeah, I mean, his stuff was okay. You know, he was 90 to 92. Uh, he was working behind in the count fairly often, but, you know, he was down in the zone. He wasn't up. He didn't make a ton of mistakes up. And, you know, he, he gave up one hit. And it was one that... Uh, that definitely would have been fairly controversial, I think, if uh, the Dodgers had lost this game one nothing. Dave Roberts decided to stick with him for the sixth inning. You know, I would have sent in Brandon Morrow, but the problem was uh, Alex Wood was pitching a no hitter, so that was a that was a really interesting moment that kind of got washed away uh, with the way the offense came back. And it's really kind of playoff baseball is really fun, isn't it? Just because of how to stop. You don't no no that. no no from the standpoint that like the narrative just changes like, oh, dramatically. Oh yeah, 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 the whole thing. You know, yeah. coming into today, it kind of was a feeling of like doom and mm -hmm. oh boy we don't know what they're going to get out of wood and you know I think what in his last start you know when what was it like four and two four thirds and two and, thirds and right? gave up three bombs. yeah and you're kind of thinking okay if it goes like that again they could be in trouble all of a sudden they're down three one and now you're sending Kershaw back mm -hmm. you know poor guy in an elimination game right. and now it's a totally different situation yeah. they're gonna they're gonna send their guy out yep uh, with the chance to go up 3-2 yep. and then take the series back home. I mean, everything, you know, and then again yeah. with the offense kind of breaking out the way it did late in this game, uh, I think it kind of showed uh, what we thought coming into this series, right? That if you get into the bullpen, uh, the Astros bullpen, damage. you, you can, can do some damage, wow. and they absolutely did that. Yeah, and the Astros do have a way to maybe patch things up bullpen-wise. You know, they'll have Brad Peacock back uh, in a couple of days. They'll have um, uh, McCullers back, uh, possibly. And uh, well, no, they won't have McCullers. I don't know. Uh, who cares? You know, the point is, is that the Dodgers, you know, they were able to get the offense going. Cody Bellinger had two opposite field doubles. Um, that was really big for them. Jock Peterson hit a huge three-run shot off Joe Musgrove late. So, yeah, I mean, it's Kershaw and Keuchel round two tomorrow, game five. Uh, it should be a lot of fun. Yeah, and it's, uh, I thought, you know, again, the way this team has just kind of come, you know, the fact that even when things weren't going well and they, you know, they've been having trouble scoring runs, the fact that they could put up five runs in the ninth inning the way they did, mm -hmm. I think does kind of show that result. You know, it yeah, really for sure. is, you know, and I kind of hate to kind of give these cliches any credence, you know, but like in this case, it's actually kind of true where they, they kind of talk about just kind of sticking to the process. Yeah. You know, the fact that they didn't, they haven't dropped Bellinger down in the right. lineup, right? There's right. kind of no panic. Let's just right. keep doing our thing. Eventually things will go well. We saw that happen today. Yeah, I mean, you know, they, they trust in their talent. They have a lot of talent and what they've shown, you know, this season and, and really this postseason, they're, they're fairly resilient. So, you know, now they're going to give the ball to Clayton Kershaw tomorrow with a chance to bring the World Series back to Los Angeles with the Dodgers in the lead. Either way, we're going to be here tomorrow and then we're going to be back in Los Angeles the day after that. You can read all of the coverage in the pages of the LA Times at latimes.com backslash Dodgers. Follow Dylan on Twitter. You can follow on me on Twitter. I don't care. Um, but either way, have a great night.